let's do some Rocky Top, a very popular bluegrass tune. Uh, let's see, uh, this, is, this is my own little rendition of it. Hope you enjoy this. And I'm going to get started here with three pinches. Okay, now it sounded right, right here. You think, where in the world are we going? But actually it works in context. So I'm, what I'm doing is I'm pinching five, two, and one all at the same time with my right hand. That's my first pinch. My second pinch, I'm fretting the first fret on the second string, leaving the other two alone. And now I'm just going to scoot my index finger up a fret. And then I'm just going to hit the first string by itself. So I've got pinch, 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 first string, hammer. Now we've seen some of this in Foggy Mountain Breakdown with this two to three hammer on the second string. Okay, so pinch, 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 one, hammer the second string, five, two, one, five. And this I know we've seen with the double hammer straight out of Foggy Mountain Breakdown. Two, one, two, one, five, two, one, five. Except I'm uh, leaving my finger there on the third fret. So that's hammer, hammer, five, two, one, five. Now, um, this is kind of an adaptation of a C lick. It just goes by real quick. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to hit this note. Second fret on the first string. And now I'm going to scoot on up here to the fifth, fifth, fifth fret and do a five, two, one, five, three, one, excuse me, five, three, one, and then back here I go to the second fret. So that's, okay, and I'm counting the beats, one, two, and three, four. And keep the pressure on this and get a little bit of a gliss here between these frets. Add a little flavor to it. Okay, now I'm going to do a G lick. Uh, starting on one and uh, sliding on the third string from two to three. Three, two, one, three, four. We do that in quite a bit. First string open, then slide. And notice I'm going back here to the third string with my index finger. So I'm doing three, two, one, three, four. Okay, and this is, this we've also seen, this is from Fireball Mail again, this little two and five slide. And coming around the mountain and uh, what else, what else did we do that in? Will the circle be unbroken? So that's third string, sliding on the fourth string from two to five. Combining that with a four, three, one forward roll, four, three, one, then a five, three, one. And then we're going to go to a little D chord, and it's just two fingers of a D. Your whole D chord. I'm just using my index and third finger. And going three, one, four, three, one, five, three, one. Okay. Now here I'm going to do a slide on the third string, but I'm gonna my index finger's already here, so I'm gonna use it. Okay, to do my usually I use my second finger, but since this finger's already here, just go ahead and use it. Here's my double pull move that I've done a bunch of times. Th uh, three, two, three, one, and pulling off from the third fret to the second fret on the third string. Okay, and if you if you still need a little help getting definition, two clear notes here. Just, just work that. Just remember to press both of the notes first, and then pull this one off too with just a little bit of a pluck. Okay, I'm going three, two, three, one. Open three. Here comes my fourth string, third string, second string. It's another pickup into the second half of the tune here. And now I'm on the first string and hammer. And 
same thing I did before. Hammer, hammer, five, two, one, five. Here comes my little C lick again. done this before too I think it's a four diverse roll and I'm going to start with um, my second finger on the third fret of the third string open second string first fingers down here on the first string second fret and five so three two one five and then take those off one two three one there's my pull off and um then I do a three, two, four, one, another pull off, five, three, one, five, and then my Scruggs G run at the end, starting with my index finger. Three, one, five, three, one, three, four, one. Okay, so I'm going to start that four reverse lick again. Three, two, one, five, and pull off. Three, two, four, one, pull off, five, three, one, five, three, one, five, three, one. Okay, and from there I'm going to go straight back up to uh, the top line and skip the pickups. Go, go straight up to the first string again. I'm sorry, first string. Hammer, five, two, one, five. Hammer, hammer. string D chord side double pull four three two one hammer 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 Starting off with my pinches. See if I can do it uh, not full speed, but something like that with the pickups. By so one, two, three, four, one. <laughs> this helps and I hope you enjoy this. I know it's a, it's a cool old tune. Some might say it was so popular that nobody does it anymore, but I used to do it all the time. So I always enjoyed it and hope you enjoy it too. Hope you're having fun picking this thing. It's a, a good instrument.